A university don, Abdel Noor Ali Muhammad, has affirmed from his years of extensive research the strength of mobile money as a viable tool to driving the economy of sub saharan Africa, thereby bridging the gap between the rich and the poor. We at SIM at the university we have been examining uh, the, the economy of Somalia if, since 2000, 2015. And the uh, last two years we have been trying to to study on specifically how mobile money is affecting the economy of the Somali. Ali Mohammed of the Faculty of Economics, Simad University, Somalia, reflect from his paperwork tagged measuring the contribution of mobile money services to financial inclusion, a study on Harmud EVC Plus in Somalia, the situation of the dwindling economy of Somali region in which financial institutions cannot catch up with. Ali examined the role of mobile money institutions in banking the unbanked people, especially those people living in the far remote areas of the region. Do Somalis people have access to, to banking services and other financial institution services and, and how that mobile money can, can help to the access of a financial system? And given that mobile money is a, an instrument, a very big instrument that we just see the currently the will which moves the economy of the Somali. Tagging it a significant concept that cater for all and sundry. As a financial inclusion platform, mobile money, according to Ali, meets the demand and target of the sustainable development goals, therefore separating it from the concept of financial development. It has realized that sub-Saharan African countries and uh, this region, Somalia and even East Africa region, doesn't know, people don't have a bank accounts and even they cannot uh, they don't have a, a requirements is minimal requirements of the bank so just uh, that people should don't have a, a financial literacy the bank is don't have the infrastructure to reach for in a remote area and a rural area so a new concept has emerged that uh, mobile monies and a mobile service need only a, a very minimal requirement and infrastructure uh, to establish a banking and banking system. So financial mobile money has uh, accelerated the access of people to, to banking service. And the access to the bank service has uh, increased the inclusion of people to the financial service. And to the access of a financial service is what made and uh, what has uh, facilitated people to have a financial inclusion. He added that financial inclusion through mobile money platforms captures those who do not have the basic requirements for standard financial ecosystem, hence bridging the gaps and serving as an instrument to financial access to many vulnerables. He also posits that financial inclusion increases per capita income, upgrades social welfare and personal investment in education and health services. Financial inclusion, according to him, supports to deepen financial markets and not just small businesses. In his recommendation, mobile money proves to be effectual instruments to promote financial inclusion. Hence, financial institutions and the commercial banks should develop financial products that are easily functioning via mobile money platform.